another Saturday is here with us. Thank you so much for your time. This is the White Carpet, and my name is Gladys Osayo Radio. So, um, as usual, let's um, just recap some highlights of the week. So, um, we have this guy who says that he raps faster than Sakodia and anybody else. I am talking about Gemini. Yes, so um, if, if you haven't heard Gemini rap, well, today you get the opportunity to hear Gemini rap and hear the fastest rapper, and you get the chance to be the judge. And you know, um, this guy keeps making Ghana proud. Ghana so, so proud. I'm talking about Fuse ODG. He has gone after Samini. He has actually gone picking up the mobile awards. So, um, Fuse ODG, we'll talk a bit about him here, of course. Um, you'll hear Francis and Nana talking about them. So, this is the white carpet. Once again, you're welcome. Stay with me as I walk you through the issues in the world of entertainment. Boy, boy, boy. Yeah, guy, yeah. Yeah. It's your boy Samini, Ghana. You're watching this and I'm telling you, meet me live on Joy News this Saturday on the white carpet as I take you through what I've been doing so far for the past few months. It's been a bit silent, but here we go again. Catch me, boy, on the white carpet at Chitsa. The white carpet at live on Joy News on Multi TV is brought to you by Airtel. <laughs> we do every weekend here on the show we hang out with one of your favorite celebrities tonight we are hanging out with Ghana's finest dancehall artist Samini hi Hello. it's a high five for me thank you, there you go. Um, every musician seems to have a tattoo either on the arm and mm -hmm. neck somewhere on the body mm. what's up cool, cool, cool. Well, it depends on how you feel about certain things you know as you grow things happen and then you have reasons why you do wanna do certain things. Mm -hmm. I have my tats for my kids. Mm, I you see. Know, so yeah, that's what I do. Are, they, are their bodies also tattooed? No, they're only kids. <laughs> <laughs> they're only kids. Yeah. So maybe when they grow up, yeah, Yeah, but I mean, I don't, I'm, I, I was not restricted as much when I was growing up, so okay. I like to allow people to feel free. Mm. But the restriction came in when I wanted to do music and daddy was not too sure, but then mm. again, Everybody goes through that before eventually yeah. you prove yourself. Mm -hmm. yeah. I never know why music is always a challenge in homes when somebody wants to take up music as a career. I spoke with a mother whose son won a competition yesterday and I asked her when he said he wanted to do music, were you happy? He said, no, I wasn't happy, but now God has crowned him, so you know, yeah. there's always one thing like that. Yeah. Um, somebody wants to know how many children you have. I have four. Four I have children. I have three girls and a boy. With the same woman? No. And a gossip, three. forgive me. Yeah. It's 3-1. 3-1. Three one. Three one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 me try it, me try it. Anyway, let's, <laughs> let's just go back to um, your career as a yeah. musician. How much music do you still have in you? Um, I don't think I've even started anything yet. You <laughs> I know. see. Yeah, because I came out at a very early age. So most people that have followed Ghana music for quite a bit might mistake how old I would be yeah. because of how long I've been around for. Yeah. But I guess that's what you pay for, yeah. being petri petri to come <laughs> out too early, right? Yeah. I came out when I was like 21. Okay. So I've been doing this for close to a decade now. Mm. And this is where I find the, myself at the, 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 the level where I can entertain the rest of the world and feel comfortable that I know what I represent. Sure. Yeah. Okay, so um, you traveled out for some three months, you yeah. came back, you yeah. announced your presence we're on Kwabna Kwabna's um, concert mm -hmm. and you said we should watch out. You, I mean, how did you enjoy your performance on that day? Yeah, it felt good to be back home and be back on stage in Accra. I mean, when we got to Ghana, we just went straight to Tadi to do Kaki's Kaki Top Tour. Mm -hmm. It was uh, stopping at Tadi and we had to make it for it. But to be in Accra and be on stage for the like the mainstream Accra audience is usually something that you need to be on top of your game and it was my first night after all those months out there so I really had to come and come correct mm. yeah so talking about Kaki um, what's the relationship between you and Kaki people are uh, let me just hit it straight people speculate that um, Kaki is your fiance or girlfriend <laughs> <laughs> no, Kaki is not my girlfriend. But I don't you know, have in the world, there's never a normal co co uh, co relationship between exactly. a, a, yeah, a guy and a lady when they're working nicely. Yeah, but in this case, Kaki is um, 
a young girl that came out with a good talent and then somebody suggested to my label that we help bring her out because they thought she was good and she stood a chance for winning uh, a reality show that she didn't win so we should give her a chance so that's how we started linking up and she's a girl that grew up in down and saw how i came up and how i made it she be, she telling me now the things that i used to do in down Suman that i didn't know people like her were watching mm. so she's my baby kind yeah. of kaki i know it when we, we, you know, she's in uni. I mean, she's she's a, she's a baby. <laughs> she's not my girlfriend. So okay. th those wondering. I'm not um, dating Kaki. I'm even looking forward to meeting whoever is brave enough to want to handle my little girl. Let's see if you're ready. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, I'm sure this this um, proposal, this offer, is from a clean heart. So just in case you doubt him, he's just made the offer. So um, you can prove him wrong if you still doubt him. Just make the offer, and Kaki is available. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> Kaki is his baby. Well, I have to be sure <laughs> if she's available, but... Yeah, uh, yeah, you basically <laughs> could be pulling a smart one on you. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> okay. I know. All right, so um, of course, I believe you enjoyed her collaboration with Adam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think she was being touched too much by them? Uh, it's for TV. Mm, okay. Literally. But then again, I, I don't feel that way towards... She's grown, she's mature. I mean, she's a young lady that can handle herself when the opposite sex is around. So okay. they gel nice and it's good for TV. Mm. Okay, so um, let's look at some mini moogies and um, whiskey. Mm. We're hearing lots of things. You are here. Tell us. Let's see it from yourself. <laughs> What's up with you, Westgate and R2Bs? Um, we're good. We're good. Basically, um, it's one common song between uh, among us where I did Time Bomb. It was produced by Kill Beat of R2Bs hmm. and then featuring um, Whiskey. So, and then the, the recording was made possible through Mugiz because Mugiz is a closer friend to Whiskey. Hmm. So I spoke to Mugiz, yo. If your friend is in town one of these days, you link up, let's do something together. So originally it was supposed to be all three of us on the song. And then eventually when we started, Mugis told me that he would rather me and Whiskey do the song because they already have a series of songs with him. Okay. And he's looking at this being me and Whiskey. So that's how come Mugis did not come on the song. But then I think controversy rose that we kind of left him out of the track or something but i know he would laugh when he hears this because he knows what he told me mm. to record this track and go on and do another verse because he felt like it was good for just the two of us to do yeah, it. sure this answer is not for tv no it's not for tv <laughs> no, no. so what we happened um, real, real during ghana meets niger when Whiskate was right there but yet did not perform time bomb with you i think when we do um things um anyhow at any time thinking it will work sometimes it doesn't go well for all of us mm -hmm. because uh, i think the promoters should have coordinated right how they want to see the series of performances and who comes before who and how they want people to interconnect when they're performing it was minutes before the show that they told the the the, the they told whiskey that he was supposed to um perform time bomb with me before he leaves the stage and i guess he also had his own plan of performance he wanted to do that's the excuse they gave so then it was difficult blending in and changing whatever routine that they wanted to do on stage but did you and think I it, totally it was difficult because i i was there i saw how um he ended his performance mm -hmm. and you came in so you, usually um the style was uh, who came uh, i think i was coming on with you the came band up, uh, Okay, I was coming but you with came after Westgate. I came after so him. usually we'll have this um, thing where before he goes, that becomes his mm. final song, mm. and then you join him. So he will leave us at that performance, and he will leave you there to continue. A lot of things made it difficult for the performance to really go down because okay. I was coming with the band, and he was doing the PA, and I don't know how I would have done one PA song before he leaves, and then the band gets ready with me to come on and all that. So those little things made me put myself in his shoes and understand and not take it too personal because okay. with or without Whiskey on my set, I represent Samini music and I think I do that pretty well. Mm. I have yeah. too many questions. Pink Sheet song. Yeah. Everybody seems to think you just Sarko Deer in that song. <laughs> All right, let me clear the air here. Okay. Um, Sarko Deer said something about me in a previous song, a song that was released three years ago. And then, then it was a huge song. I didn't want to go 
trying to bite on the success of a big song. Okay. But to do a mixtape, you get to free your mind and express yourself um, the, the hardest way you want to. So then I went back and wanted to find out what he meant by Konakobisa Sonibali, the Yogi Dogi Diye Samine. It was just a simple question. So if you know what you mean by that, you clarify it. If you get mad and throw tantrums because I asked you what you mean, what you meant by that line, then it becomes controversial. Mm. But then controversy sells. Yeah. If they don't talk about you, you're not relevant. <laughs> That's true. But yeah, Pink Sheet was one of the efforts that went hard. I was yeah. out there in, in, in New Jersey and then I I added, uh, yeah, I just had them release it and it already caught fire in Ghana. I was laughing looking yeah. at the reviews on the internet yeah. and it's good. It's good for the industry. But you know, um, the, the, whilst you were away, um, Shatawale actually apologized um, for his behavior during mm. the awards, um, Ghana, um, Ghana Music Awards, Kaki's um, success mm. that he felt wasn't fairly mm. judged and um, he did his song. And then um, later, we heard from you, and it was more like a response to Shatawale. How is the relationship like now? Um, what exactly did you hear from me that sounded like a response to Well, I, 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 I might not be in the position to really um, say exactly, but mm. I, I think I also caught up with the, um, some of the speculations that mm. you, you, you needn't have done the pink sheet because Shatawale also seemed to have had his share in there. I don't... I don't I think I heard anything like that, really. Mm. And Pink Sheet was not targeted at an individual. Okay. I spoke about the fact that real has to recognize real, mm. and that, that um, if you're not real, you're eventually going to fade away because it only takes real people in this business. So who the cup fit will wear at the end of the day? Is Shatawale a real person? I would not be the one to judge that. You watch him? Well, I watch him. Everybody, like, um, it depends on how you... how talent appeals to everybody. I think it's a very talented artist. Mm. Yeah. But as to people being real or fake. Is he a real a talent? He's a real talent. That yeah. will last? I can't put my, um, I, 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 I am not responsible for that, but I, I don't wish him to fall now because the more strong talents like that we have in the Ghana reggae scene, the better. Talent wise, I, 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 no, I have to say that he's a, he's a force to reckon with. He says he's the dancehall king and you are just a dancehall artist. That's what he <laughs> says. We leave, it for, we leave it for the fans to say. What know. would you say in one, uh, uh, just a sentence about yourself as about an artist, myself. a dancehall artist? Well, um, one sentence. I'm a crucial entertainment outlaw. Mm. You know how I do. When I come out there, I represent mm. myself to the fullest. Yeah. yeah. Mm. I agree with you, though. <laughs> I've I been try. a number one fan of you. Thank you. <laughs> I try. <laughs> okay. Right. Um, so we've been hanging out with Shatawale. I hope that he has answered. Hey, did I say Shatawale? Mm -hmm. You know, I have to, maybe I'm being mischievous. <laughs> yeah. Because you kept saying Shatawale, Shatawale. No, but no, I actually because wanted to you, ask you. Because you have <laughs> so much you still want to find out, right? Yeah. I, I actually mean, want to ask we you, are we expecting a collab between you and Shata? For the, for the, uh, the, the strength of Ghana dance hall, that mm. would be something heavy. But yeah. I don't think it will be anytime soon because of busy schedules and people on different levels mm. doing different things. But eventually, a track with not just me and Shatawale. Imagine a beat yeah. with myself, Stoneboy, Shatawale, mm. um, um, who else? Um, Kaki. Mm -hmm. um, I see Jupiter. Uh, Jupiter. Yeah. You know. And now you have AK. Okay. A, a young dancehall artist. She's okay, I'm yet, to hear. Yet, I'm to yet to hear her yeah. too. But something like that, you know, I, I can see a track like that being yeah. like something good for the streets, mm. you know. So, yeah, big up dancehall movement in Ghana. I mean, we've been fighting for it to get to where it is right now. Yeah. I've been doing this. I stood my grounds when people didn't want to watch dancehall. Exactly, yeah. we, 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 we did three dancehall because they were not ready for the patois. Yeah. And now it's like the system is ready to I hear and you know and you know it's all good. We're looking at a big Ghana reggae dancehall show that's mm -hmm. going to be strictly us doing our thing. Yeah. All right, Sabidi, um, there's still too much in me for you but I'll know, spare you now. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah. So um, how soon are we getting a video for Time Bomb? Um, we hope we are able to um, uh, in the midst of all the uh, busy schedule, come by something and then shoot a video for Time Bomb. But other uh, potential singles are on the album. Album title, Next Page. Next Page. Almost ready. So 
watch out for it and then um yeah a lot of surprises on the album mm. so yeah we were out there um for about three months and more we did four major shows out there in north america and canada and it was good so where it is right now i see afrobeat taking over and yeah. african music is like the the, the next gold mines yeah samini i won't let you go without a, a, a freestyle from you <laughs> i you know you 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 um i came here to just <laughs> chill with my fans i mean interact with the viewers i haven't seen them for a long time but we love to also see time. you saying what you think so it's all part mm -hmm. of the chilling out with us okay boy bumper overload type of bumper we block road do. just the sight of bumper make me feel so good my soul food means my button and work our face cause come i make serious under the joke you make man confused and no fi kopu don't much no bo me to a means my bonu boy yeah you are naughty i just uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right so we've had a few of samini on the white carpet i hope you got your um, questions answered. You, whatever you wanted to hear from Samini, I hope that you satisfied your curiosity. So, this has been a session with Samini, the versatile, dynamic um, musician. He does that all. He, I'm sure very soon you'll be getting some highlights too from him. Very soon, I'm sure. Yep. Probably I'm daring him to wait. <laughs> <laughs> so, we have been hanging out with Samini. In a moment, you have your favorite critics joining us on the white carpet to review all the issues in the entertainment industry. Don't come around, I want pretty ladies all around me That sexy girl with the bad physique I've never seen a girl like you Ten to one, that's the countdown She's about to explode and come to fusion My girl, she's bad, she's number one I've never seen a girl like you That girl, I tell you she be time bomb Move, don't talk, boogie, baby, why not? Hey, your body, baby, fine on This guy and boogie, no be mine on No, no, this body be designer some girl fine, but you find her. Please continue to wind up. Tell me never seen a girl like you. Tell me they go wine. Time bomb. A body fire. Time bomb. She my desire. Time bomb. She me lose control. Explosion. She said she fat sexy Nina. Time bomb. She came with a friend called Sabrina. Time bomb. Don't stop this Sanina. Time bomb. Baby go to. I just want to love you. Share with me your problems. Girl, you are the type of girl a bad man need. I just want to love you. Share with me your problems. Girl, you are the type of girl a bad man feel. Lean on me. My girl, you are the only one for me. You're the only thing I see. Lean on me. I are the only Say she just come again. Me say she must come again. Man, I really general. My drum credibility, you know me got it. The girl let me testify. Say for some me, me never like it. No way. Man, I really general. My drum credibility, me never like it. Hey yeah. And the girl let me testify. Say for some me, not then me got it. Me just come again. Me just come again.